There are several ways to step up your chicken keeping game, and one of them is to hang your chicken feeder. One of the most obvious reasons to hang your chicken feeder is because you will regain floor space that was previously taken up by the feeder. This gives your chickens more room to move around. Chickens should have feeders that are raised up to the height of the middle of their back. This is the rule of thumb regardless of whether your feeder is hanging or sits on the ground. Hanging feeders are very easily adjusted to be raised as your chickens grow taller. Chickens with properly adjusted feeders will waste less feed due to billing. Billing occurs when chickens scoop feed out of their feeders with their beaks and it lands on the ground. They ignore the feed on the ground, thereby wasting feed. The equipment that you will need for hanging a feeder starts with a hammer and nail that you place in the rafters of your chicken coop. You can use a hook instead of a nail if you wish. It is better to use a chain to hang a chicken feeder rather than a rope. Ropes will need to be tied and untied, which leads to fraying. Ropes can also be chewed through by rodents. A simple S-hook is your friend when you want to remove or adjust the height of your feeder. Make sure the S-hook that you use fits in the links of the chain. Lastly, you need a feeder that hangs. When searching for a hanging feeder, you can look for plastic and metal styles. Some metal tube feeders can hold up to 35 pounds. To adjust the height of your feeder, simply move the S-hook up the chain. On a weekly basis, check to see that the feeder tray is at the height of the middle of the chicken's back. To lower the feeder, move the S-hook down the chain. Double check the height of your feeder and its clearance in relation to the shavings or the ground.